Hey everyone, Martin here, one hour playthrough and welcome to the experimental build 0.26.01 Stranded Deep and I decided I do an experimental build video because what they added is so good I couldn't wait for the final build and what they did is we have roofs oh god finally we finally have roofs so um, I'm on my um, experimental island or I populated all sorts of goodies so I can start building and uh, yeah let's get right to it the first building I want to make and show you and I probably do some speed building for the big building but for this one I will talk the time Now I have to say I'm probably going to change it, especially because it's the experimental build that I'm using a, a refined hammer and <laughs> right now that's really what you want because oh boy it goes so fast with the durability, it's crazy. For the total build I want to make it's two, uh, maybe a small extra building, um, three of these hammers and if you use the normal wooden hammers uh, it's crazy. <laughs> it goes so fast. It's uh, it's it's crazy. But um, yeah. So first of all, I want to do this particular building now. I've been practicing quite a bit, and it's a little bit finicky to put walls on these types of structures with these corners. So I show you uh, the way I'm going to do it, and I recommend. Right now, for at least the experimental build, that you build it in one go and don't remove walls later because they don't really connect properly together. But again, experimental build. So um, let's put an arch in, a brick arch. And what I'm going to do is, is going to be brick building with a uh, touched roof, a touched roof, right? So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, surround it with. Um, window walls brick window walls I need a whole bunch of them but luckily I've got so many as you can see I love it from this game that um, it's really good to make videos YouTube videos because you can prepare so easily now you can see I can place it pretty easy the walls but this is not always the case so the way I'll do it is right now the way I recommend you do it works for normal walls as well but if you put the foundation first down and you try some walls it, they just won't fit they turn red and it just doesn't work it's really weird so uh, it needs to have some tweaking and does that look like a cat face to you? <laughs> I don't know all right, so let's do this. Uh, two more. I think it's such a good improvement. The roofs are looking pretty, pretty nice. I'm gonna show you in a second. We're almost done. We start building the roofs. And let's do the arch quickly. So for those who didn't know, you have a cartographer uh, which allows you to make islands and drop all sorts of stuff on it. So that's basically what I did. Just make a quick ladder here. There you go. Alright, so for the roofs, um, I started especially with these triangle structures because they have special roof types. And there are the, um, the root roof wedge corners, and that's what I'm going to use. You can turn it with Q or E. And again, it's sometimes finicky, so you can build everything, all the skeletons in at once. But I notice it doesn't really work, and sometimes the hitbox is gone and you can't hammer them. So this is the way I'm doing it right now. 
I don't think they are looking so good. It only needs four little hits from this uh, refined hammer. It's pretty fast. There we go. Excellent, one more. Perfect. Alright, let's quickly put the door in and then we have a look. I have some rope over here, lashing. And let's quickly grab three. I mean, I've got a whole lot. <laughs> a whole bunch of stuff here. Alright, let's put the door in. Uh, doors. And I like the plague doors. That's why. Alright, and I need water. So, that's for the first house. I think it's really, really nice. Very, very nice. Yeah. That's a very good addition, and I'm sure it will come into the final build. I'm pretty, pretty sure about it. I have little doubt. The walls inside look like this. You still can see some wood. I don't really wonder if they leave it like that, but we'll see. We'll see. Alright, so, um, start building number two. It's going to be a big one. So, let me prepare a little bit. Let's make some room. don't really need them in my hand because uh, I will start pretty close. So yeah, I'll be uh, right back when it's morning else I'll start building in uh, the dark and that's not really good. Alright, brand new morning, we're back and I made the foundation uh, of the new house. It's uh, quite a big house and if you want to build this you need quite a bit of clay but uh, yeah. Um, I didn't want to show you everything it's a little bit tedious. You've seen how the walls and the foundation is built, but the roof is a different matter. And this is what I really like to show you. So let's get start. Let's start building. Um, first of all, let's go to roofs. And this particular roof, um, basically, you can only do it at one one way. Basically, one way. Um, else there's a good chance it fills like things like that that you hit through the hitbox it's really weird As you can see it's still a little bit finicky and it starts raining as well there you go got the hitbox now it's supposed to be that the better the roof and clay roofs are the best it should be waterproof i can tell you already it's not the case in the experimental build so i'm going to guess they're still working on it let's hope let's hope that's the case so let's build the four sides First, that hitbox is really weird. Again, it's an experimental build, so I'll bet there's uh, definitely room for improvement. And what I'm going to do right now is let's put this one on. We haven't seen this one, and I will build that in a second. It's pretty high, and uh, this is why I wanted to show you this particular build. Oh, it's raining in earnest now, holy shit. Seagulls are growing mental as well. <laughs> Alright, so what I will do is uh, to fix that roof. Best thing to do is go to walls and take the cheapest wall you can build. I'll just do a brick half wall, place it over there. Then, because I have so many bricks, uh, I'll put a floor in at this particular side and I should be able to make steps now right over here perfect 
and this allows me to build this. There you go. Super nice. And you can see I did this on purpose just like this because I can really easily remove them now. So no need to build them completely. This is what I wanted to say. There we go. Switch back to the hammer. And let's look at the other corners. Um, which are the, oh, the clay roof corners. And they will be fitting perfectly in here. There we go. Excellent. I think the rain is going to stop. So now is it? I think so. I think the sun is coming back. Oh, it will be good. Oh, yes. Great. All right. Let's put this one on. Almost done. It's really nice. I really like this build. Um, but you need an incredible amount of clay for this. It's crazy. Um, each foundation is for clay on its own. The corners are pretty cheap right now. They're just costing one, but... Again, it's experimental build, so everything can change. And I wouldn't be surprised if they include something like wood as well, because, well, we need some timber here. So I wonder what the final recipe is going to be. But look at this. Ain't this nice? And what I'm going to do right over here is let's put a roof cap on this one as well. Ooh, that's hammer number two already gone. It's crazy should have one more there it is this is how much I've been practicing <laughs> I know exactly how many hammers I need and I've got some wooden ones for spare but they go so very very fast it's crazy all right actually you can put another arch in here if I wanted to might might actually be looking pretty good let's do that as well let's put a stone arch in here just for finishing touch decoration wise i will do that much later and uh, maybe not even in this video this video is purely to showcase the roof types that we have look at it that's just so very nice i really 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 like it i think um there's room for one more uh, structure to build and showcase one more roof type Let's put quickly a brick foundation over here and maybe put some half walls. I've got so many bricks left, so why not? You can place them first and then just... Um, uh, I'm thirsty as well, apparently. But we're almost done. My character uh, has to wait and suffer a little bit of thirst. Let's do these quickly. Um, this one. There we go. Almost done. What I love about this game is the, <laughs> the sound of the sea. It's fantastic. Maybe that's why it's one of my most favorite games of all times. So I quickly put some stairs in it. I don't have enough bricks, it says. Well, a few left over here. And I think the house I'm making right now is something like the storage. All right, we're full, perfect. The storage facility. So I'll put some stairs over there. And I was thinking, put a wood roof cap. I thought it was th thatch, but it's wood, it's just wood. Perfect, excellent. And then suddenly from an empty island, you have this. And actually, 
maybe this is better if it wants to fit at all but no it's too late and there we have it i actually had to break down the complete structure including foundation because i couldn't place the arch anymore but there we go put the door in put some half height brick walls and a wooden roof it looks all really really nice some stairs here you go excellent even the stairs oh hang on There we go, even some stairs. Excellent. There you have it. I hope you like this update. I really do like this new expansion. It, it makes a huge difference now with that we don't have to use, oh, what's happened to the building? <laughs> that we don't have to use any more floors to make a roof, but we have actually a proper roof. That's so really nice. So yeah, thank you very much for watching everyone and stay tuned for the next update and for now thanks for watching i will see you next time